Hello, it's Nathan, and welcome back to Cassepi's. In the previous episode, we went with Meredith to the haunted mall, grabbed her vinyl record, beat up an archangel. So if you haven't already, check it out. I'll have a link, probably appear on the screen sometime. But we also upgraded, I always forget what it's called, but we evolved our crow dude. And he's this guy. Pretty cool looking. Uh, the last guy that we need to do is this Catelli. He's almost there. Hopefully we'll get him done. But we are right before the cultist uh, village. I'm not really sure what you want to call it. We've got Kaylee here. We're going to go in huh? and figure it out. But just in time. In time for what? Where is everyone? Is something happening? Let's scope out the place. Scope out Morningtown. Kind of a creepy name. You know, hey, I'm from Morningtown. You mean like good morning? No. Morning as in someone's dead. Kind of spook. Let's see what this book is. The scribbled note says, this flying saucer creature will emerge from its shell if given the ability to remain close to its opponents. If given the ability to remain close. Huh. I mean, we've definitely seen those types of enemies. Can I break this? No. Interesting. That's kind of cool. Oh, I wonder if that means... Let's see if anything's back here. I wonder if that means he will evolve differently if he has more melee attack. That would make sense. Huh? What are you doing here? Why aren't you at... Wait, is that you, Kylie? You're a deserter. Better beat him up. So this guy, all seer. All right. Usually call for help. Okay. Man, that does so much damage. Catelli's pretty strong, I'd say. All right. Let's actually try it again. Finish off the old lightning bolt. There we go. Got our own all seer. Wow. Look at that. More than half the damage of his health. Another one. <laughs> the rain sometimes gets really close to the camera and it kind of looks like it's messing up. Ah, so easy. Hopefully Catelli evolves. Yes. Broadcast gives the user multi-target status for three turns. Neat. Ugh, deserter. I don't even remember this man, but he seems to remember me. Let's keep going. All right. Before we do that, we are going to evolve Catelli. That was what we were wanting to do in the previous episode. So that's how we're going to do it. I don't mind wasting the resources. Just wood. All right, Catelli. You betcha. Oh. Kind of interesting, their hand. Cat five. <laughs> I like that. It's kind of resembles like cat of nine tails kind of thing, but you know, cat five ethernet. Whilst his face may resemble a plas plasma screen display, cat five appears to have no difficulty in seeing. Seeing it lacks a mouth, it draws static electricity out of the atmosphere with its twin cable tails in order to power itself. That's really cool. I really like the designs of the monsters. And let's, I think I said this in a previous episode, but something like Pokemon, you know, they kind of have to sh follow their same uh, design, you know, like you kind of know what to expect out of them. Some of them are pretty surprising, you know, don't get me wrong, but uh, this kind of reminds me of Digimon where you just don't know what you're going to get. I mean, we had this crow guy he was just like a normal crow with like a hood and he turned into a centaur looking thing, but he's supposed to look like he's riding the horse because of the skull in front. Really cool. Wait. You aren't wearing robes. Oh, they're not whatever, whatever. Yeah, we're gonna beat you up. <laughs> Don't mind me. This guy's really cool. Salamagus? Uh oh, Amagus. Don't do it. I think he's really cool. I really like salamanders. Uh, but 
Uh, poison, not the best idea with this guy. Let's go to air. I think air does something. Now nah, we'll, we'll take out Wolter, guys. Ooh, we need to uh, put a sticker on Kylie after this um, to go with charge. Yep, there we go. Power me up. Roll again, spit. Interesting. Do we have nurse? Could just heal ourselves, I guess. Is it always just... Yeah, I can heal myself. Okay. Might as well. Um, there we go. Really boosting that AP boost. <laughs> pyro million. Chameleon pyro, yeah. What do we got here? One lowers their target's accuracy. That seems like a good thing. Let's do it. Sorry about that. Okay, I'm back. Um, my dog was squeaking on a squeaker toy and I didn't want it to come through unless it already did, but no no problem. Uh, but I saw that he rolled some dice, got a 17 and did a lot of damage. But we should be able to get him here. You won't stop us. So are they like fire? No, he was only fire. We'll make sure to go back before we like fight the boss. Uh, let's save it. Okay. Um, what I was wanting to do was apply that sticker. Battery. Yeah. Because they have charge. Oh, okay. All right. Let's see. Anybody? I think we're, we've got a pretty strong team with these two, I'd say. Yeah. Uh -oh. Dorian, huh? Lots of thwackalopes. Um... So we're going to have to, like... So I think if I charge, let's do this. Nice. Yeah. And then battery. This is the one that, is it upgraded? No, the, the metal one was, okay. Getting confused. Are we gonna? We might do enough damage to uh, stop her from. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's so much damage. Nice. Okay. Okay. Door unveils a button. Boink. Nice. Okay. Probably gonna have to fight this guy. We got a pretty good combo, I'd say. Especially if they're conductive. Let me see. I wonder if that would be a good idea. Energy. Oops. Stop. Stop. 
Hmm, we won't get enough AP. Um, I'm thinking we just smack for now. <laughs> That's okay. Does that do anything? No. So let's charge now, and then we'll be able to use um, battery afterwards. Oh yeah, this is gonna be real easy. And then battery. Having two crits like that, that is a huge amount of damage. Tap five is my MVP so far. Same thing with my Wultergeist, whatever it's called. What is Dorian up to? I'm worried. I'm not. These wells make me want to go down there, like, because I've been playing a lot of Tears of the Kingdom and, uh, very, just a fantastic game. Love it. All right, we're still kicking some booty. What was that? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Serpent God. I was gonna say, are you gonna have a serpent thing then? I wonder if there's like some kind of combo where I can set up, um, I forget its name, Catelli, but, uh, so that we can always get an extra AP. I'm curious. Calling for help's got to be one of the best moves, just because it adds another body to be hit. You know? Oh, so close. Deja vu. Oh, characters with multi-strike. Okay. I like the attack name. Appropriate. New leaf, remove status effects. Cool! I was wanting that. I that's really strong. Monster. I kinda wish you could do something with these, like maybe search them or something, you know? Maybe they'll become something once we free this place of Dorian's grasp. Alright, I think after this battle I'm going to go back and... Well, we'll see. I still have one more. Didn't know we needed a pillowcase to get past you guys. Um, let's see. I think this guy, if we charge, yeah. That's okay. Let's, um, let's just spit at him. We're going to try to do a bunch of damage. Yep. I was hoping for that. Brother Cooper. Hmm. I wonder if those are different people. Anything back here? Come on, you gotta have secrets. It's like Paper Mario. Oh, well. Hey, buddy. Uh, 
All right, so we should spit at him. Ooh, that caused him to go berserk. Interesting. Cause that, he's like the, the whatever, I don't know what you want to call it, but. Guess we'll smack him for now. Disturb. Astral. Right. But this will buff him, right? Oh no. Interesting. Provoke failed because he's berserk and can't use that. Nice. Does such little damage. Fine with me. Okay, that'll increase it. And then we will do battery. Maybe electricity doesn't affect astral. There are some types I think that don't do anything. a lot of defense. Oh, he only had the one. Easy peasy. Mi amigo. They are. Morningtown key, status resistance. They use their attacks to reduce damage from the burn poison leech status effects. Okay. Is that just a passive? That's kind of nice. Let's see who we can give that to. Only Wultergeist, huh? Interesting. It seems like it's a metal one, but hey. Ooh, I can't have all these. Let's see if we can get rid of one. Um, Because we have a lot of stickers. Sharpen, I don't think we really need. Yeah. Cool. He's our he's gonna be a good little uh tank tank debuffer. Okay, so we got the key. I don't see a button for that though. Is it like up? What's up there? I wonder if we can jump up on the roof there. Let's see. At least battles are going kind of quick. Ooh, this guy's going to be kind of resistant to us. Yeah. Hmm. I need a switch because he is, yeah. So he's ground, which I know metal is good against. Dang it. Cold story, huh? Try again. Gear share is the one I was thinking of. There we go. Timers reduced. Interesting. Interesting. Nice. He just wanted a sandwich. I see, I see. Can I actually get over there? Lock the shortcut too. Okay, so we had to do that. Interesting. Anything over here? No. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. 
All right, I think we're gonna fight this person um, and then go back. You gonna like hurt me with fire? We'll see. Whoa, that guy's cool looking. That helps us our guys are so quick. Oh wow, he's he's a champ. He's taking that. I wonder if the poison will kill him though. Yep. Lots of resources. Okay. Let's see something here. Okay, that definitely seems like the end. Ooh, is there something over here? No. Okay. Well, let's go back. Can't fast travel. Is this like a dungeon or something? That's okay. Oh, I can just fast travel. Bonjour. Doesn't use up your turn if eaten during combat. A thousand. Jeez. I guess I'll just buy one just in case. Use it in a pinch kind of thing. Hmm. Okay. Let's heal up. And we'll go back. Oh. We're evolving again? How exciting. I didn't know that. I thought they would only evolve once. Ramtasm. He's pretty cool looking. The Ramtasm, ooh, I like the sound, has honed its connection between the spiritual and physical realms, and it's able to fully manifest itself across both simultaneously. This gives it access to an untapped well of tremendous astral energy. Wow. Sounds pretty strong. How cool. I didn't know they could evolve twice. Tidy. Alright, so let's go back. Alright, let's save it. Good old magic crap. You know, this game... Here, I got an idea. Let's do this. Oh, that's opened. I'm a dork. I'm a dork. Um, this game reminds me of Persona. Uh, with like... The little monsters that help you and talk to you sometimes. Um, kind of like, uh, what is his name? He's like a little devil guy that's like blue. Who's like Shin Megami Tensei. Um, kind of like their Pikachu. I don't, you know, don't quote me on that. I've only played like a tiny handful of those games, but I can't remember what he's called. Um, that's what it reminds me of. And then like the bosses talking about like their inner demons and stuff you know self-reflection and all that so definitely persona um let's save it okay um i'm i'm i like i like him just because calling for help and then poison and stuff and he's fast <clears throat> Is that your sister, Kylie? Jacqueline, may we have quiet in the audience. Who is she? Is she my replacement? Creepy. What the? Weird. Dorian will now speak. 
Look at this guy. I wonder if he's supposed to look like a certain cult leader or something. How's it going, everybody? Listen, guys, born children or whatever, you'll all be doing such a great job with the digging. I mean, seriously, this is a primo, primo quality hole. If it is as deep as your devotion to the cause, it's like a metaphor. When I first heard the whispers in my head guiding me beneath the earth, I knew I couldn't do this alone. And sure, we've had our ups and downs, <laughs> but we've done it. Pull the curtain. The serpent god awaits us, baby. There we go. Do not enter the chamber and bargain with him for a share of his divine power. And to accompany me, our prodigal, prodigal, prodig prodigious daughter returns to us. Whoops. Oh no. Oh no. Kaylee, honey. <laughs> you look like a deer in the headlights. Of course I've got word you were joining us for a big party. Didn't you tell your friend here that you helped run this place alongside me? Sorry. I'll explain later. We need to put a stop to this down. <laughs> you didn't believe in me, did you? Well, it looks like I was right all along, baby. There was a real damn archangel right under our feet. We, I, something about fighting one. If you go in there, you'll you'll get yourself killed. If you and your friend have so much experience, why not come and join in the fun? Come on, watch me ascend to godhood with the new archangel, yeah, buddy. On. Yes. Jack, as you wish, sir. See ya. <laughs> See ya. Ugh. I hate him so much. Come on, let's go stop this idiot from whatever he thinks he's doing. Can I like jump around first? We're gonna kind of explore. There's a house. Anything back behind the house? Of course not. Why would there be? Oh, what is this? This is his bed. He's got like a lot of money underneath of it. That's funny. See, I like that. I like a little storytelling. Give me something. If you're not going to have loot in there, at least give me a little bit of story. Ah. The pressure here is overwhelming. It felt like when Morgante first appeared. Yep. All right, let's save it. Ooh, even the menu's all glitchy. Yeah. Kylie, Kylie friend, you made it. Kylie's friend. I made that tactical decision to amend the plan, sir. Kylie and friend will go ahead first, and if they aren't instantly killed by the Archangel, then I'll go and do my sweet talking. You're a fool, and you're going to get yourself killed. You first. Anything over here? I don't really like the glitchy effect. It's making me kind of sick. They always arrive by train. Very interesting. Whoa, it's an archangel. It gives me that horrible feeling I had when we fought Morgante. Like I'm looking at it all wrong. Have you heard my call? Are you here to pay tribute? Are you here to burn for me? I love that everybody has little wings. Whoa. Man, look at that dude. Here goes nothing. I've heeded your call and traveled to the abode. For my loyalty. Oh, I didn't even get to. Is he just going to smite him? Wow. Did he just get vaporized? You do not take from me. You only give. Ah. I told him this would happen. Come on, AZ. Let's stop this thing before it kills anyone else. Holy smokes. It's like the darkest thing of this game so far. Morning Star, Serpent God. Okay. We'll definitely... Oh, I can't even... I can fuse, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, we'll do this. We'll fuse when we need to. Um, I don't think I can... Yeah. Temptation. <laughs> I see. Serpent God with the tree, huh? Apple tree. I get you. I get you. Um, charge. Interesting. Am I gonna like smack into that? I think that's the only way to find out. Come on! Uh oh. No effect. Okay, so it seems like melee. Okay. Here, let's do this. We will fuse. 
He's so cool looking. Start the anime. Okay. I don't know if that counted as me um, doing charge. I guess there's only one way to find out. No. Okay, good to know. Good to know. That's okay. You can multi-target one guy. Okay, so we're going to charge again. Unless we should be doing something else here. Let's see. What do we got? Criticize. We can't debuff him. Wouldn't hurt to... Didn't we have an air wall? Here, let's try that. Look at that tiny little thing. So he hurts himself for temptation. I see, I see. Okay. So he's got his full thing. Let's heal. Judgment. Oh, that's what he did to that guy. Whoa! Okay. I guess we'll just hit him with the good old lightning bolt. Oh, okay, even range does it. Does it just do random effects? Okay, let's do charge and then we will hit him with... No, not charge. Yeah, charge? Yeah, yeah, charge. And then we'll hit him with battery. Pretty good chunks, I'd say, especially with him killing himself. We'll just, we'll just keep doing it, I guess. Charge. I guess I can poison him. Yep, I'm poisoned. Ooh, that's a lot of poison. I wonder if poison does a percent. Okay. He's going to smack us here. Hey, let's do post pustule, pustule bomb. Doubt I'm saying that right. I wish I had something that I could buff myself. Do I have anything? I guess I could call for help when he does the. Uh, the apple tree, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guy's a little bit easier than the other one, I think. Yeah, he's gonna die here. Um, let's just heal. That's one way of wasting the apple's turn. Dunsky. Get out of here. Ooh. Nice, nice, nice. That's the thing I was wanting. Okay. Woohoo! Another one down. Increased by 14%, and now we can glide for four seconds. It's a pretty long time. All right. If you wish to leave this land, then he heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the past most long. To the west your wings must fly, to the place only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie, halls now empty and alone. We're getting there. Oh, there's that dude again. Morning star, is that right? Boy, do I have a job opportunity for you. Hmm, some humans got in here. Run along now, will you? Dorian! Sorry. But it's its own fault. We should all get out of here. The air here tastes like death. Dude got vaporized. Uh. 
the commune will will open its gates weird we will try and find common ground with the rest of new world we only wanted guidance we never i know the people of this community aren't bad people you just have to be wary of those you put faith into words to live by that was messed up are you okay i'm i'll be fine i feel awful for helping dorian for so long but i blame him more than i blame myself I found the Morn children around the same time he did. He needed that sense of community and belonging. He and I became good friends. And I was something of an assistant to him. I don't know if things just slowly changed or if things were never good, but Dorian's hold over the people of Morningtown became something sinister. It became about him, he, his wants, his dreams and delusions. It was no longer the community I desperately wished it was. People were hurt, and I helped smooth things over for him. No, I wasn't his assistant. I was his fixer. I felt for so long like I was doing good, helping them maintain a positive status quo, even if people would get hurt now and then. I'm not a good person, AZ. Yes, you are. I'm glad you believe that. I hope they all do better with him gone now. Lost people look for guidance, and that's where Dorian offered them. Well, we're another Archangel down, and I'm going to help you find the rest. Woohoo! You can now fusion power when fu you can now use fusion power when fused with Kylie. Fusions you form with Kylie now have a 10% added strength. Mm. That's cool. Another angel battle that ended with an appearance from the Triangle Man. I'm picking up a pattern here. Anyway, you said the song you hear in your head is getting longer. What is the next line in it? For that is where my chambers lie. Hall's now empty and alone. That's still too vague to help us out. We need to find another archangel. Right. Let's crack on. Where are we off to next? Didn't you hear some rumors about something happening in the Meyer Sea? We could see what's happening there if you want. Oh. That's where I was going up there and I was like, I'm going to turn around. Interesting. We have so many quests to do. We still have like the ranger stuff to do. Okay. Let's go back to Harbor Town. I'm gonna kind of do a little sweep, make sure there's no like side. Okay, see. So you quit your job because your bosses kept screwing you around. <laughs> Pretty much. It's more than that though. If I went to work somewhere else, I'd just have another boss giving me orders. The only way to break the cycle is to work for myself. No yeah. more bosses. Yeah, that's the spirit. No more bosses. Live on your own terms, man. Though my career plans have hit a roadblock recently. I think it happened after I fell through time and space and ended up living on Monster <laughs> Island. It happens to the best of us. Bonjour. Hello. How much wood? We have a lot of wood. I ain't worried about that. Au revoir. See ya. Okay. I guess we could like rest just in case something happens. Whee! Sure. Okay. Funny anecdote about her life. I don't know if this, the person singing is saying ship or shit. Oh, here we go. Hmm. Captain Judas is camping on island southeast. I know he'd probably hate me just for relying on modern conveniences, but he's just so hot. <laughs> okay. All right, so we got like lots of captains, lots of whatevers. Um. So far, I'm not seeing anybody with the quest. Oh, 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 it's loading. Fire enough. Wee! I think there's like someone really close by, if I remember right. Here, let's see. Oh, yeah! I forgot I was doing this planting thing. I don't know where the last one is. Very odd. I forgot I was doing that. I'm, I'll probably have to look that up some other time. I'm not going to look around. I didn't see that. Winged rabbit. Trembling ground. Seems like we might need to go back there. Captain Zed. Oh, that was a guy that fell asleep. Maybe we'll go there. And then we have Captain Skip. Excuse me. Let's see if we can find him real quick. We got a little bit of time for this episode, right? Okay. Is that them? 
Someone said that. Here, let's see what's over here. Oh, we don't want to go in here. That might be Captain Skip. Let's see. Hello? That is Captain Skip. Boy, the offworlders really make a lot of stuff, don't they? Greetings, I'm Skip, one of the ranger captains of New World. I gather and sort all the stuff you offworlders make that ends up here. Electronics, furniture, you name it. Gets all washed up here and put to good use. One world's trash is another world's treasure, after all. Say, are you that new ranger trainee? The one who's got a knack for fighting? I suppose I can take a break from my dumpster diving if you want to take on my challenge. All right, guys. Stay tuned for the next episode, because we're going to be fighting Captain Skip. And uh, maybe we'll uh, we'll come out the other end a victor. But as always, this is Nathan. Thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. I will see you.